the first step is a plug into the pour. The analogy that I make in the office is I tell people to kind of close their eyes and visualize a Coca-Cola bottle that's about three-quarters full mm -hmm. of soda. Because just like a soda bottle has a tapering where you mm -hmm. screw the cap on, the follicle has a tapering, and that area is called the, the isthmus. Okay. And where the isthmus of the follicle is, the cells will proliferate, choke off the follicle, prevents that fluid, which mm -hmm. is not soda, but it's semi-liquid wax or sebum, from coming out of the follicle, lubricating the skin, traps, ruptures, inflames, and you get a, get get a lesion. lesion. Yeah. Right. right. We talk about bacteria being an important part of it. So can you explain that a little bit to sure. folks? So, you know, the skin is not a sterile envelope, that, which is something I explain to patients all the time. There are fungi, there are viruses, there are bacteria that are normal inhabitants on the human skin. And one of the key players in acne is a bacterium called Propionibacterium acnes or P. acnes. <laughs> 